Oh man, we're facing a little unexpected difficulty here in Colombia filling our propane tank. We got this little one gallon cutie here, it's our baby. But this kind of a connector is really safe. In the US, they love this thing. But down here, they don't have the adapter, I guess. So came here to try to fill it. And basically he said, you know, we don't got that adapter here. He said, try down the road, there's another plant. But if not, he said maybe in the center of town, we can go to a hardware store and pick up the adapter. He gave me a name of a business and a location where they might have those kinds of pieces. But let's go check out those, see if we can find an adapter. If we can't find an adapter, backup plan would be to see if their regulators fit on our system and get another tank. Or we can drive eight hours to Medellin where on iOverlander people say they'll do it. We got it! This adapter thing! So in here you see there's like a there's like a thing down in there. Yeah. That their there. system doesn't usually have that thing. That's like an extra safety feature of ours. Ah. The adapter, this part here pushes that open. Ah. And then it leaves out here the normal system. Right. So that they so. can fill here. But I mean having the adapter is a big win, if not for Colombia, for the rest of the country. So Danny's going for a round two, trying to get our propane filled. As for me, I'm just gonna be sitting in here with somebody dying gram working. I am actually pretty sick. Like, sometimes you just don't have the right gut bugs and now I'm getting those added to my system and it's kind of rough. I just can't really eat much or drink much. <laughs> or my stomach starts to hurt pretty bad, so. But hopefully we get propane and maybe we'll be able to cook for ourselves and I'll be able to figure out what does sound good for my stomach. <laughs> right now it's like the saltines. So, <laughs> can only go up from here. <laughs> so that did not go well. <laughs> the guy said by law he can't fill this. Yesterday the guy here said he could fill it if I had this piece. He said try next door. Next door yesterday, they weren't as friendly as here. So, well, we'll go try it out. The law here where propane tanks are owned by the refilling companies and that's a legal obligation. That way they can keep the tank safe and maintain it. So basically they won't fill up a tank unless it fits their tank. So the one option was hopefully finding one of these companies that was cool enough to do it for us. Ooh, it's hot out there, try my best. But we're gonna head over to Home Center so we can try and get the little green Coleman um, containers because we do have that camp stove just in case. We'll just use that until we can figure out how to fill our tank. Hey, on iOverlander, eight hours away, there's somebody who, who will do it. Well, I'm gonna go check out Home Center and see if they have any propane for us. Center sells these weird shaped protein propane bottles. This is not in the camping section. This was in the plumbing section because people use this for blow torches. Oh. Yeah. But it looked like the right connector. And Emily was just reading it. This is in English, made in the USA. <laughs> so this will be good enough, you know, for a while. I mean, we know some place in Colombia will fill our bottle. But yeah, I think it will be a lot easier to do it this way rather than getting a whole new setup. So here's the moment of truth. Yeah, you're right that I shouldn't really, oh no, it fits, yeah. If I were to do it farther, it would start spewing propane. <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah. So. so Home Center sells some propane. Wow. Great, 14 ounces. Wow, well we don't know what killed our stomachs. 
but we got some kombucha. And plant-based yogurt. <laughs> Ooh, that probiotic should help. This is plant-based yogurt. It's limonada de coco. It's a base of coconut milk. It's got the consistency of regular yogurt, and it tastes like regular yogurt with like lemon, lime, coconut kind of thing. I haven't really been having any kind of an appetite, and this is like really, really tasty. This is a really nice neighborhood of Bucaramanga called Florida Blanca, where you find all the vegan things and the fancy shoppies. Graham hasn't had nori in ages. Yeah, we finally found it here in Colombia. Oh, he's excited. Oh, okay. Ooh. is that good nori? And apparently it's good for cats. It's good for humans. Definitely Siéntate. good for dogs. <laughs> Nobody wants nori. I like just holding it like this and letting them, letting them bite off pieces. This is such crunchy nori, it's nice, right? Yeah. I think the humidity really got in the other packages. This nori is like so crunchy. Check out this spot. Both animals loving it. This is a paragliding launch ground. We got the whole view of Bucaramanga down there. And this area is closed on the weekdays. We have this older ourselves, but here's like a climbing wall for the weekends. And just a nice grassy field. There's potable water that comes right from the mountains. Bathroom over in that restaurant. Pretty sweet. What do you think, Remy? What do you think, somebody? Oh, she loves it. She was playing with the dogs. Okay. Graham. This is perfect for Graham, huh? It is perfect. <laughs> so let's have some lunch. Yes. But look at this cat over here. I hope he's not stuck because that is the cutest way I've ever seen him sit. Just looking out at the view. Oh, he's going for it. Man, this paragliding is looking so sick over here. We're gonna go check out if Emily can do it today. Yeah. Emily got all signed in. We met the guy. He's the son of the guy who checked us into the camping area here. Really nice. They're planning to travel South America on motorcycle. I think most people would have been asking questions about paragliding, but we were just talking about traveling. <laughs> but uh, I'm sure he's gonna explain some coming up. So Emily's getting ready. Oh man, what do you think? I'm stoked. I haven't done anything like this before. So. You nervous? I honestly thought I would be more nervous than I am. I think with maybe my stomach problems this week, I don't have any nerves left. My stomach's like all tapped out. But I guess you guys will be able to see my face whenever I jump off. So <laughs> we'll see how nervous I look then. <laughs>
Hey, your legs still work. <laughs> wow. Was it awesome? Yeah, that was cool. <laughs> <laughs> wow, game, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you liked it? Yeah, it really did. That was really fun. What was it like? Like flying. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, that thing you did right here where you guys are like choo choo. Whoa, circle. whoa. That was insane. <laughs> like, yeah, the G's were all hitting me. That was insane. He was like, do you want to do my no, mayor? Uh, something like that. And then he, I was like, no entiendo, ¿puedes explicar un poco más? And he went like this, ¿Quieres hacer esto? And I was like, okay. <laughs> he said it, yeah. Maybe he was saying, do you want a lot of fun or a little bit? Of fun? Maybe. Well, no, no, no. It was like a, it was a verb for sure. Oh. Uh, yep. That was so fun. Yeah, I almost got nauseous just watching it. I was just trying I to film it. Spin it in circles. <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't have to tell him to land or anything, so I guess I was, I'm good enough. I'm pretty sure. We gave you some extra time. Oh, we sure did. Dude, gracias. <laughs> wow, we <did> gracias. <laughs> that worked out to be $30 for 15 minutes, so $2 per minute. That's a very expensive phone call and a very cheap hang <laughs> Yeah, that was so much fun. It was a little wild, like the wind did pick us up and drop us a couple of times, but like he did it perfectly. But yeah, um, I am a little bit nauseous. Oh, I'm sure nice. it comes with the trade. Oh. The more you get used to it. But also, yeah, I've been. I, this is like the second day I'm not sick, so it's fine. <laughs> yeah, they said. They said, so tomorrow you'll start your classes on your own, and I started laughing. <laughs> 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 thank you guys so much for joining us if you like this video let us know in the comments like and subscribe see ya